Hello again everyone. Um, as you can see I got the uh, bed off my truck here. So I'm going to try and talk a little loud. I got a respirator on. So anyways I got a new uh, a new um, recipe for undercoating. It was given to me. Uh, a guy on commented on my other video about using bar and chain oil for an undercoating and I uh, in my last video I thinned it with diesel fuel and it, it seemed to work but it got washed off pretty quick so he recommended heating the bar and chain oil in a crock pot with paraffin wax or uh, toilet ring wax so uh, he recommends using summer blend bar and chain oil Husqvarna brand now I had some uh, I think winter blend Johnson red and some summer blend it's Itasca or whatever that crap was in that green jug so I just mixed the two together and uh, like uh, he recommends adding a uh, block of paraffin for each quart let me grab you a block real quick here before we get started just to show you what it is this is just what I had laying around I didn't buy it I just had it laying around it's uh, gulf, gulf wax and I think uh, they come in these little blocks see there's two of them here so he rec recommends one of these blocks per quart or one toilet ring uh, wax you know like the gaskets so anyways you, you put that in the crock pot heat it up and uh, I'm using it in my fluid film gun I did buy a cheap spray paint gun but um, I wanted to try it in my fluid film gun first but as you can see the bottle on these are plastic so I'm just got it it's it made the plastic flexible and it's pretty hot but it's not melting through the plastic so just be careful so I think I got this thing set on 80 psi right now let me get out of the light just gonna spray it I'm just gonna get a good little coat on there I'm being pretty liberal with this stuff because I'm, I'm probably not going to be able to uh, get a get the other bed on it till spring so it's going to be sitting and so it, it comes out and it I think this is about the consistency you want it's kind of like a grease like a light grease and once it dries it'll get a little uh, get a little harder you know let me uh, go to the other side of the frame So, uh, this was sprayed a little earlier yeah it kind of like a grease but uh, this Thomas Bartlett the guy that recommended it to me he said he's been using that recipe I think he said for 25 years up in Vermont so I figure if anybody knows how to deal with rust up anyway in this country it would probably be them guys up north up in new england they get it pretty bad up there we get it pretty bad in pennsylvania too but i think they get it a little worse so anyways that's uh that's my new recipe so we're gonna go ahead and spray the rest of this frame down and uh, move this truck out so anyways thanks for watching and uh, leave any questions or anything in the comments